Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to show and discuss how we execute the playwright JavaScript test by using the Selenium by using the Selenium grid, right? So Selenium grid is basically a Selenium uh, component. By using that, we can run our Selenium test on the remote machine, right? So playwright also supports. Uh, selenium grid where we can run directly our test on selenium grid environment right so let's see how we do that so for selenium grid uh, if you want to do right here you can see this is the official document of the selenium grid integration with the playwright so if you go playwright site documentation then here un under the integration you can see there is selenium grid also click on this right here you will see playwright can connect to selenium grid hub that runs selenium 4 to launch the chrome google chrome or microsoft edge browser so if we are going to use the selenium grid then we can run our test script either on google chrome or microsoft edge on other browser it will not run okay so uh if we want to configure our playwright test to run on the selenium grid then only we need to add the environment variable right selenium remote url in environment variable only one configuration we need arrest we don't need it will automatically connect and run with the selenium grid so let's see how we configure so first of all download the selenium web driver so this is the url from here you can download the latest version of the selenium grid okay i'm going to run on the chrome browser so i will download the chrome browser uh, so chrome drivers this chrome driver is depends upon the browser version like i am using here chrome version uh, 113 113 so in that case i am going to use and download the selenium uh, chrome version 113 so i can download from here as well as selenium from here latest version i have already downloaded these two and put in one directory so in this folder i downloaded this is the chrome driver xt this is the selenium latest version so first of all we need to run our selenium server on local machine or in the remote machine where we want to execute so in this time i am going to run a playwright test and using selenium grid on the same environment right so we have here uh, selenium grid we can run the selenium server how we run open the command prompt okay then type here java hyphen jar selenium so this is the latest version selenium 4.9.0 jar and then i am going to run this in a stand alone mode so i will use here stand alone so now selenium grid is going to run in selenium stand alone mode you can see this is the server url of the selenium server right so we need to copy this and set up in the uh, environment system right where from where we are going to run our automation test so automation test is available here in my current local system as well as server is also the same right but if you are running in the remote location your grid server so we need to set up the environment variable right uh, of this url server url and the machine from where you we are going to trigger the test so this is the my machine right where i am going to trigger the test so we can go to the environment variable okay click on the environment variable click on the new, the new. okay you will see one pop-up is appeared and here we need to set the path uh, selenium remote url copy this and paste what value we need to uh, put here variable so this is my server url so server url is this one okay paste it here and click on ok click on ok okay okay so now uh, configuration is ready selenium server is running as well as i set up the selenium url in environment variable 
okay now let's run the set test now you don't need to do anything at your test level right in your code level when you run your playwright test first of all it will look the environment variable like selenium remote url in environment variable if it's found the environment variable then it will run the, your test on that particular uh, remote location on the grid environment if that is not available then it will run the locally locally means without using grid so i have already set up the environment path of the selenium url so now if i run the test it will pick the url from the environment variable and then trigger the test by using the selenium grid so let's see running now just i click here so in that case it will run on the by default we have set up these three profiles chrome firefox and uh, edge so it's executed all the three browsers right uh, because the profile has uh, for all the three browsers in the playwright config file you can see chrome firefox babkit so that's why it's executed on all the three environment but if i go here in the chrome section you can see it's run successfully it's passed but if i go back and other browsers like firefox and babkit so you can see browser launch connecting selenium url is only supported the chromium chromium means either we can use the chrome browser or we can use the edge browser so if i go in the babkit babkit also not working okay so you need to remember if you are going to use the selenium remote selenium grid to run the playwright test then we can execute only on the chrome browser as well as the edge browser not the other browsers okay so in that case we can set up the configure only one profile delete the other profile or we can create and we can run our test from the command line where we can pass the profile chromium let's now run the test from the command line npx playwright test then pass the file name so like i am going to run the test file uh, checkbox and radio button so it has the two test pass the file here then i am going to run on the only chrome browser so just pass the project chromium Okay, run the test. You can see only checkbox radio button file will execute. This is the project. Okay, launching the test. You can see executed. If we want to see the reports, let's see. If report is open now these two tests run successfully on the chromium browser 